points and lines. Let's start with points and lines. What's a point? Hmm, well, I think we all kind of know what a point is, don't we? I mean, even if we can't really define it. For now, this is a point. It has a specific location. Let's call it point P. Now, if we put a bunch of points together, we eventually get a line. Strictly speaking, this line, or any line, will continue on and on in both directions. Sometimes we indicate this by drawing arrows pointing in opposite directions at either end of the line. Okay, time to mention two special pairs of lines. Parallel lines and perpendicular lines. Parallel lines are two lines that never meet. They go on and on in opposite directions, but they will never touch each other. Parallel lines do not intersect. Perpendicular lines are two lines that do meet in a special way. They intersect each other at a point and form a square corner. See that square corner? Actually, notice that there are four square corners where perpendicular lines meet. We can also say that perpendicular lines intersect to form a right angle, but we'll talk about that later. Okay, back to the discussion about our friend, the line. We can look at just a piece of the line if we want to. We can stop the line on each end at a particular point. There. That's our original point, point P. Let's call this one point Q. We now no longer have a line, we have a line segment. By the way, point P and point Q can each be termed an endpoint, because that's the point at which the line segment ends. Okay, we can name this line segment PQ. Here's another line segment, which we can connect to line segment PQ. See how the two line segments are joined at point Q? This new line segment can be named line segment QR. It has an endpoint at point Q and an endpoint at point R. How about the whole thing? We can name this line segment PQR. Hey, if you're wondering if we can end the line at just one end, we can. It will look like this. There's an endpoint here, but the line keeps going on and on in this direction. We call this a ray. You know, this is a perfect time to talk about angles. 